Yo, 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 what's up? You know what it is? Checking in. Back in this thing. What's going on, everybody? Live from Nairobi, Kenya. So, um, tonight we'll have an interesting conversation because a lot of, I want to do a live like this because a lot of people be asking me about poly and polygamy and that's what they really want, blah, 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 blah. But I know it's a difference between what what dudes like think it is and what it really is. So I want perceptions, perception versus reality. But the dudes want to do that, you know what I'm saying? Because a lot of dudes just think of the, like one side of it and they don't think about everything and what it really is. So yeah, so tonight I'm gonna I'm a try and break it down for y'all so y'all can know the difference between the reality and what people think it is. You know, because it's a real big difference because, you know, it's not really as, as like fun and crazy and wild what people think. I mean, it, it can be that, but it's that's not really the purpose of, you know. So, but yeah, man. So tonight we got a real good show coming up, you know. Got Lucy in the house. You know, she's going to tell y'all how things really going, you know. Kenya was really going on and how things really are, you know. So, yeah, so. Here we go, man. Really good show. There she goes. How you doing, Lucy? That's what's up. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Chilling, 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 chilling. Yeah. So, what do you think the the like the biggest misconception about polygamy is in Kenya? Mm -hmm. <coughs> In Kenya. In Kenya. In Kenya, it's easy for people to be in many relationships or marriage because they are raised uh, traditionally. You know, everything involves traditions. All right. So, but now, before it was okay because, like, you could hear, like, the old people, they could say he married the second wife because the first wife could not give him kids. All right. He married the first wife. Uh, second wife, because they agreed. All right. With the first wife, she cannot. She don't want to have no more kids. Maybe she has like eight now. She doesn't want to have no more. So the the family could agree. But now it's all about benefits and power. Like the men of nowadays, they are getting to it because of power, and the women because of the benefits that comes with it. So you so you saying. Polygamy, the family would have to uh, agree to it and it was mostly based on having more kids. It was all about kids. If you want a big family, what, what's, what's the benefit of having two wives if they are not giving you a big family? All right, all right, all right. So, what do you think the biggest misconception is? With how, like, Western people think it is? You know, if you think if you have money, you, are, you, you, are, you can, be, can have as many wives as you can. So, you can't? Are you raised to, to maintain? Are you uh, able to? Huh? Uh, Not meals for everybody. <laughs> no, I'm saying, I'm saying, you know, it's not always about providing because, like, right now, if you ask a woman, would you be a second wife? The first question she's going to ask you is, are you able to provide? Provide. Yeah, that's the only thing. But you, as a man, are you able to provide to comfort her emotions? You know, to deal with all those multiple emotions from different women. Are you able to to provide without feeling like you're struggling for it? And it has to be equal for all of them? It has to yeah. be equal, right? No, the first wives, first wives, most of the first wives used to get like the best because they have been there. But now for women, it becomes like competition because the second wives think she's there because she's better. So, all right, so it sort of comes a competition between yeah, wives. Yeah, a competition. Then the kids, they start fighting. He's our dad. They, he, I'm, I'm the first kid of the first wife, so I'm supposed to get this. We have seen it even with celebrities here in Kenya. It's either they die or they or the family split. So do most of them live inside the same house, or they have separate houses for each, for each family? Who lives in the same house? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Women are jealous. They don't want to share. So nobody, they don't. Actually, they live far away. Before, you know, back then, back then, it was normal. But nowadays, it's all based on what you can give. 
it's it's beneficial. So everybody is jealous because as, a, as you being the husband, you are juggling between two women, trying to please them, and the women are the women don't even care about you. They just care who is living a good life. All right, all right, all right. Mm -hmm. So, um, so tell me, so good. yeah, yeah. No, it's go. it's good. I got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so you heard it right there. 